Hi, welcome to Introduction to Web Development, a quick video on creating wireframes. So a website wireframe are simply line drawings that show the placement of elements on a web page or an outline, beginning thoughts of how a website is going to be laid out. They're not difficult to produce or create. And just a quick video here on using paint to create a wireframe. I recommend that you start out in paint by simply creating a white page and for general purposes I started at 1280 by 800 as far as my pixel size makes it give it a beginning concept of a normal size web page as you can see my screen resolution is a lot bigger than that so I'm going to start out just by creating a box and I'm going to take that box whoops make sure I have the right tool done and I'm going to take that box and just go from corner to corner to kind of represent the beginnings of a web page. Click out, I now have my line. Then I'm going to top, start with creating my header and I'm going to create a simple line. Start oh, about there, hold the shift key down so that it's a straight line, doesn't matter how I draw it and go to that end again click outside so now I have that that'll be my header area so if we're gonna do the header let's just go ahead really quickly and create a footer again hold the shift key down doesn't matter where my mouse goes and I now have a footer area so now let's talk about where we're gonna put navigation you're gonna to have to decide whether you want a horizontal navigation or a vertical navigation or possibly both so in this instance I'm going to have a horizontal or excuse me a vertical navigation and again a quick line down and do you want to have a side area for additional information or is this going to be your general area for right now I'm going to say that this is just going to be kind of a two column area this will be my general area in the center so what I'm going to do now is I think each one of my pages will have a graphic and let's use the box tool again oops going the wrong way so again I'm going to kind of try to even this out and I've got my shift key down so it's moving it as a perfect square and if I let go then it becomes a rectangle instead of a square and then I'm going to go ahead and go with an oval here and create out that's where my logo will be and one more time this time I'm gonna go like this and this is where my page information or um, site title will be and let's see I think that's pretty much oh let's just put one more over here and I'm gonna say this is going to be my quick contact information okay so now I've got just a general wireframe a lot of times people will go ahead and label it and I just quick my alpha tool and go logo and click again on my alpha tool and I'm going to say this is going to be um, company name and over here I'm going to say quick actually I want to kind of get that a little bit more centered but quick contact info and over here I'm going to put simply navigation and here I'm going to do page picture and content and down in the center here I'm going to do footer 
Okay, so that's a quick overview. I will now save this file, save as, and let's get into a folder about this course. And I'm going to save this one as Wireframe Demo. And that's how you create a wireframe. I hope this helped you out in understanding what a wireframe is and how to quickly create it. Thanks for watching. Keep watching for more videos.